Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. I did not get an opportunity to go shopping this week until Saturday afternoon. So let's go ahead and get started and see what was out there. If this is your first time tuning into my channel, welcome. My name is Pam and I love to thrift for home decor. And I also have a booth that I love to purchase items and resell in my booth. If you enjoy this type of content, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. I'd love to have you as part of my family. Check out this strawberry pitcher. I think those strawberries are adorable. It's only $3.99 paint loss here and there, beautiful buffalo check, or is it gingham, around the top part, and it's just so summery and cute. I came across these three brass and copper items. The first one looks as if it is a dipper, and there were two other items. I thought they were all lovely and many people like to use this as decor in their kitchen. The last two pieces were $3.99 each. I love this color. This picture was such a beauty and quite heavy. It was on the top shelf. It originally came from Marshall's. And I was sad to see when I brought it down, it had chips all along the rim. You know, there are many varieties of salt and pepper shakers out there. I've seen all different kinds. And I ran into these Lighthouse salt and pepper shakers. There were two different kinds here and I thought they were both in really great condition. Each salt and pepper shaker was only 99 cents. They all had their stoppers and looked to be well taken care of. Ooh, I love the color of these mugs. And I love that they are stackable. 99 cents each. They're vintage mugs. They had lots of crazing on them, but they were so beautiful. I found this Pyrex lid. It has the image of a sunflower or a daisy. I'm not sure which one that Pyrex labels this as, but anyway, I know that many people out there that collect Pyrex are always looking for a lid, so this might be a good purchase. I found this little porcelain shoe, but I don't understand why there's a little angel on it. And $3.99 is quite a big price for this little tiny piece with chips.
This must be the day for salt and pepper shakers. This is a sweet little pair of Inesco Clown salt and pepper shakers. They look good by the front, but the back, lots of lots of paint loss. 97 cents each, not a bad price. And this clock is a Project 62 clock. That means it's from Target. I like the clock. Uh, the hands are a little wonky, but I just think it's got a great look to it. Look what I found tucked away. The cutest little strawberry teapot. Now this is the teapot for one, and it is 99 cents. You can't beat that price. And just look at those beautiful strawberries. Have you ever been tricked well, this bowl here tricked me. I thought it was Pyrex from the distance. And as I looked closely, it's plastic threshold. So that means it's another item from Target. Christmas is coming, and it's time to go ahead, start looking at those Christmas items. Now, these gingerbread houses were too expensive, $5.99 each. One was a tea light, and the other was a candle. The first thing that I would like to share with you are the three blue vintage mugs that I found. I absolutely love the mugs, I love the color, and I'm going to place them here at the coffee bar, and we're not gonna use them because they are full of crazing, but we're just gonna use them here just for a pop of color. Next, I picked up both pair of the Lighthouse salt and pepper shakers. The pair on top, are more ceramic and the pair on the bottom are made of wood. All of the salt and pepper shakers are in great condition so I'm going to be placing these in my booth for maybe eight to ten dollars each. I could not pass up on these Christmas salt and pepper shakers. They were 99 cents for both shakers. They are in great condition and Christmas is coming, so I plan on placing these in my booth and selling them for $10 to $12. Somewhere out there, someone needs this Pyrex lid. I'm always finding myself needing a Pyrex lid for a piece that I find that I would like to sell. So, I'm hoping that I can sell this one in my booth. I bought it for $2.99, which was really high, but I'm gonna to try to sell it for six to seven dollars. 
Look at this gorgeous little strawberry teapot. Yes, it is a teapot for one. And I was a little nervous when I got this teapot home because I didn't dig in and take the lid off in the store. So I was thinking there may be a chip inside, but there wasn't. I was so excited. This little teapot is as cute as it gets, and I'm gonna sell this in my booth between eight and $10. All right, everyone, that is my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I think I did pretty good for hitting up just a few Goodwills on a Saturday afternoon. So if you enjoy this type of content, go ahead and like my channel, subscribe. It's free, and hopefully I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.